Gamers, Carla here, and today we're going to do the G major open scale. It's your second major scale. The major scales are important for folk, country, and bluegrass, classical, and understanding the guitar in general. Also good for technique. So let's get started. We're going to learn it one octave at a time. It's a long scale, this G major scale. It covers two octaves. It goes from G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, and it keeps going, D, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, again. So we're gonna first learn the first octave, up and down, then we'll learn the second octave, up and down, and then we'll put them together. All two octaves up, all two octaves down. We're gonna begin with a G, third fret, sixth string. The next note is the open fifth string, which is A. The next note is the second fret of the fifth string, B. The next fret, three, same string. And then we have the open fourth. Then we have the second fret on the fourth. And then we have the fourth fret on the fourth. And then the open third. So that's three, fifth string open, two, three, fourth string open, two, four, open third. And the notes are G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G. If you don't know the names of your notes on the strings, Check out the video on that, which is notes, names of notes on the strings. All right, let's go descending or backwards. So third string open, fourth string, fourth fret. Notice I'm using the fourth finger on the fourth fret and the second finger on the second fret. And nothing on open. Third fret, third finger. Second fret, second finger, open. Third finger, third fret. That's the first octave. All right, so the lower octave. So learn that before you move on to the next octave. Review that, get it really down, and then learn the next octave, which is starting now, beginning where we ended, third string open, which is G, Third string, second fret, which is A. Open, second string. First fret, second string. Third fret, second string. Open, first string. Second fret, first string. And third fret. So to review, that's G, Open, A, second, B, open, C, first, D, third, open, E, second, F sharp, and G on the third. All right, now we're going to go descending or backwards, starting on that high G, G or third, F sharp on second, E, open, second string, third fret, D, C, first fret, B, open, and A on the third string, second fret, open, third. All right, review that as much as you need to. Don't be in a hurry to learn this. And the notes as to which frets and everything are all going to be in the description. So check that out if you need a visual with numbers. Okay, we're going to put the two octaves together now. Starting with G on the sixth string, third fret. Open fifth, A. Second fret, B. Third fret, C. Open fourth, D. Second fret, E. Fourth fret, F sharp. Open third, G. Now 
we keep going. Second fret A, open second B, first fret C, third fret D, open first E, second fret F sharp, and third fret G. Now descending. G on the third, F sharp on the second, E open, D on the third, second string, C, first fret, open second, B, third string, second fret, A, open, G, scratch out that pinky, F sharp, on the fourth string, second fret, E, open, fourth, D, fifth string, third fret, C, second fret, B, open, A, and sixth string, third fret, G, home base. Okay, here's a little bonus section for those of you who are a little more advanced and want to learn these last couple of bass notes. So let's say you've already played it ascending. And then descending. We're going to add these two notes at the bottom. F sharp. Open. E. And then F sharp again on the second. So. how it's going to sound when you put it all together. Now how are we going to use this G scale? Well, as discussed, we've got Joy to the World is a really good example. I discussed that in the C major example. That's a melody that uses the scale just going straight down the scale. Ring of Fire is another song that uses notes completely out of the major scale. so that's G major super useful very good guitar key lots and lots and lots of songs in the key of G major and so review go as slow as you need to take your time really master each scale before you move on and learn another one and in the meantime if you like this video please hit like and subscribe and you'll get notified every time I put up another scale for you to learn or another song for you to learn and if you have comments or requests or suggestions, please put them below. And yes, I do teach private lessons. I teach via Skype and FaceTime and also in person in Somerset, New Jersey. Okay, happy picking. See you next time.